Fairfax Mars, and I got a lot to go over today, so I'm going to make these videos short, hopefully. Uh, the UN has essentially endorsed Hillary Clinton for president. Well, they're interfering in our election. Although, of course, they deny it. The United Nations News Center, the official UN News Service, tweeted, then quickly pulled a post that called for 8 million Americans abroad to stop Trump. The tweet, published at 9.14 p.m. ET on Thursday, urged American expats to share voter registration tool on the website of the activist organization, VAS, that states U.S. citizens abroad could defeat Trump if they voted. The webpage, titled The October Surprise of Lynn Trump, allows users to sign up for help registering to vote in the November 8th presidential election and encourages them to enlist their friends as well. At a time when Trump is trying to divide us, we could help defeat him if we all share this page with everyone. Let's reach every U.S. voter abroad, it reads. It says the tweet was deleted within 20 minutes without explanation. Ari Gatanis, chief of the UN News Services section, which oversees Twitter account, said it was a mistake. That is a lie. You don't make mistakes like this in a UN organization. They uh, were probably trying to get people to mimic the idea and spread it around. That tweet did not originate from the UN News Center, and this was the reason it was taken down, he told Political. We are looking into the providence. It's providence. That is a lie. You are a liar. Liar, liar, pants on fire. So here you have the UN that just signals its intention to interfere in our election. How do you like that? Uh, I'm furious. Oh, God. Bad enough we had Democrats registering dead people to vote. Now we have the UN basically getting involved in our politics. Essentially, they've just endorsed Hillary as one of the amounts to. Unbelievable. I'm Artifacts of Mars. They said these are going to be short. 